Hi, this is Claire from AHA. Managing large cross-functional efforts such as product releases and software rollouts requires careful coordination. You need to make sure everyone knows exactly what needs to get done and when so you can deliver on time. This is why establishing a repeatable framework for success can help things go more smoothly. So today I'm going to show you how to create, customize and apply a release template in AHA Roadmaps so you can do exactly that. Let's go! Here I am on the Gantt chart page in the releases section of AHA Roadmaps. As you can see, this view is perfect for managing big projects. You can create phases to represent the different stages in your process, set important milestones, and then you can also add features to build out the details of your plan. You can also visualize dependencies to help you keep everything on track. Every workspace in AHA Roadmaps comes with a default template. Here you can see what the template for product workspaces looks like. It includes phases for everything you'll need from reviewing your product strategy through to defining the features you want to include, as well as some of those cross-functional launch planning activities. But your team probably has its own unique process that you'll want to use. So let's go ahead and navigate over to our workspace settings and I'll show you how you can create a custom release template. You can add as many templates as you need, and you can also inherit templates from a workspace line, which is super helpful for driving consistency across teams. Here's the default product template, which we were just looking at. So let's go ahead and open it up and take a look at the details. Now you'll see that for each template, you can add as many phases or milestones as you need. You can set the duration of each phase, the days after the prior phase, and you can also establish dependencies between phases. You can also customize the color for each release phase and you can drag and drop them into order. So now let's talk about how to create your own release template. You'll need to just select the add release template button and then you'll see that you can get started with an example template or if you really want to build your own from scratch, pick the no phases option. A handy tip to note is that if you select one of these existing templates, you'll see a preview of the phases and the duration. So that just makes it really easy to pick a template that most closely matches the new one that you want to create. So I'm actually going to go ahead and pick this desktop release template. I want to create a slightly different version of this one for my tier one releases that just tend to require a little bit more effort. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to update my release template. And then let's just make a few tweaks. So the first thing I want to do is I want to increase the duration of the development phase to 15 days to accommodate the extra work that goes into tier one releases. And then I also want to add a release phase for website updates. I think the marketing team will appreciate that. So if I add a new release, you'll see that I can very easily just drag and drop it into the right spot. And then once I have everything looking right, then I can go ahead and start using it. One last tip before we go back to the Gantt chart and see our new template in action is that you can choose whichever template you want to make your default. So I just recommend picking the one that the team uses the most frequently. Awesome, so now let's go ahead and apply our new template to an actual release. So back on the Gantt chart page, we'll select add release. We'll give our new release a name. We'll set a release date for a few months out. And then at the bottom of the create release modal, you'll see that I can choose the template that I want to use. So I'm going to scroll down and pick the desktop release tier one template that we just added. We'll create the release. And then let's expand the release so that we can see the details. And you can see all the phases, the milestones, the dependencies are in place exactly as we set them up in the template. And that's it. Now you know exactly how to create, customize and apply a release template in AHA Roadmaps. So the next time you need to plan a big launch, you'll be ready to go. If you have questions, please let us know. Our team is here for you. So just email us at support at and we'll respond super fast. Thank you.